Welcome, let's make a, a simple group picker using Google Sheets. Pretty simple to do. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take and uh, copy in a list of students from another list, maybe a student list that you have from your classes. And so here's my musical list. Uh, and what we're going to do is assign each one of these students a random number. So I'm gonna type in random for this header here make it bold and center just so it's nice and neat. That's really for me because the students won't ever see that. Uh, and then we need to assign a random number for this column. And what will happen is we're going to basically force Google Sheets to pair up this cell with the name with the random number and then scramble them that way. So the way we do that is in this cell here we just type equals and then we do R A N D, open and close the parentheses and then just hit enter. And it will automatically generate a random number. And we'll just grab here and highlight and grab it and bring it all the way down. And it copies that same uh, function to generate a random number next to each name. Uh, the other thing that we can do, and what I usually do is, was I, once I have my groups done, is I'll project this uh, onto the board and then I'll just write the groups that are there. But one of the ways that you can do that is, let's say you want a groups of four or something like that. Here on this side, we'll just highlight these cells and then we'll just change the color with the fill color. So I'm gonna do this kind of blue over here, purpley color, I guess. I like blue, mist, there we go. Um, and then maybe these four, we can do another color with contrast, yellow. And then we'll continue to do this. You get the idea how this goes. Blue, We're doing this real time so you can see that it doesn't take much time at all to do this. And blue, we're almost done with this list of students. Now down here, um, we don't have enough to do um, the same amount of for students in each group, but that's okay, we can have a group of three. They'll be fine. Uh, I, think, I think that group will work well together. Um, now, so what we wanna do is we, we can rearrange these in any order. If we wanted to do them in alphabetical order that way, uh, we can highlight this whole group right here, and we'll go to Data, Sort Range, and we want to tell Google Sheets that there's actually a header. There's a the name Students is not an actual student name; it's it's part of the the list name. And then we've got it ABC, or we can do Reverse Alphabetical, and we just hit Sort, and now these are in alphabetical order. And so you could project this on the board, and maybe like write a number one, two, three, four. You get the idea. If you wanted to do random groups, then you can just highlight both of those columns together. And again, we'll go to data, sort. And again, we want to tell Sheets that there is a header. And our choice is, if we click on this, we've either got student or random. Let's do it by the random number and then hit sort. And so now they go in random numbers. And so now we have the groups that are all mixed up. And if you wanted to, you could even click on this here. You could either double click or right click, and you can hide the column. So now the students don't actually see that stuff. Uh, and you can change the view, zoom in or out, so that you can project the whole thing onto the board. And they have their groups. If you want to get it back, just highlight this here, click again, and then do unhide the columns. Simple as that. Thanks for watching.